All right, we have another retro diecast rewind, this time from Marketplace yet again. I acquired this cool little Matchbox car. Let's take a closer look. I saw this for like four bucks and had to have it. It's a uh, it's a it's a Buick LeSabre stock car. Pretty cool stuff. I like that it has a full race car interior, and I just love the fender flares. That's what really did it for me. You can see the uh, it's got a little flared fenders going on here. It needs to be cleaned, but um, I just like the way it looked and this sort of matte finish top. I don't think that's just faded. I think it's supposed to be sort of a matte finish, which I thought was really cool. The plastic base kind of stinks. I'd rather have been metal, um, much like this uh, Pontiac stock car, which had a metal base, um, and they integrated the metal into part the base as to into part of the body. See where the blue is. So I thought that was really neat on that car, but. Um, I think this one's pretty cool. It's got uh, it's got some good things going for it here. And so, um, you know, let's take a little closer look, see if we can get in here. And look in the interior a little bit. Um, as you can see, it has a roll cage and a safety net. Looks like some uh, printing in there for the, uh, the uh, fire extinguisher, or what is it, maybe a water bottle, manual transmission. Yeah, that's pretty pretty cool amount of detail. Um, Wells Racing Champion, Moroso Contingency, Bell, stickers, stuff like that. Got the uh, cubic inch displacement on the uh, hood there. Um, I just thought it was a really neat representative of what was sort of a quintessential 80s circle track car. Uh, maybe even something you might see in Trans Am Racing, possibly, right? Um, just thought it was really cool. And, you know, the Buick is, is often unloved so who doesn't love this so not a bad score for like i think i paid a whopping four dollars for this and you know i, I might have paid a few bucks more at some sort of like trade show thing or something and you know coincidentally i think i paid about the same maybe a little more for the pontiac which is considerably heavier but um you know some of this era matchbox car is really neat we got more retro diecast rewind check around the channel find some more as always smash that like and subscribe button i just wanted to say that it's so stupid <laughs>